gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm, Fairy Vixen here, back again with another video. And we're gonna get into the rest of this box. I don't know if we're gonna get through the whole thing, but... We got some interesting things. First is this one, and I don't know if it's gonna go out the door or not. It might have to stay here with me. But it is. It starts with little frosted glass and look it's got that on the back of the eh. there we go and then it goes to Aurora crystals kind of mixed in a little bit and then it goes to like a light teal turquoise colored frosted and then it goes to clear turquoise and then it goes back to um, clear with Aurora and then it has this beautiful teal and it's just so gorgeous and it's nine strands and it just it feels yummy and it's all glass and I don't know I might just have to might have to wear that one a few times before it leaves me because it's my favorite color and then we have another one of these Contro pins, and then I had pulled, I tried to do this video once already, and I realized that I had two of these, so, I don't know if these are native, um, fancy dress thingies that they put on their clothing or what, but they're really neat, and I have a blue one and a purple one, with bead, nice bead work. Very pretty. Nice. Here is a another pretty blue one. It's got two hearts, a small and a large, on a seed bead strand with little stations, little glass beads. Very cute little Y necklace. Very nice. Cute. There's some purple. Purple, purple. Seed beads. And then these are big, chunky purple uh, barrel beads. The choker. Cute. This is probably cell phone. Okay. Cell phone fob slash Keychain, it's got a tiger and tiger eye. I like the beads, I might steal those. Here's the thing, and here's the thing. And is there any more silly plastic in here somewhere? Oh, hey, I know where that goes. That goes on. A necklace that we had. I don't know if I put it. I think I probably already put it in the craft lot. So I'll throw that in there too. So whoever gets it can fix it. And this is just a mess of plastic stuff. Like kitty, kitty jewelry that's kind of in bad shape. Here's some plastic beads in a lovely shade of green. Stretchy. Oh my, what's this? Yeah. Um. Really? Okay, so this is supposed to be there. But this is not. And these are not. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, there we got, we got that under. Alright, so this is one of these guys. It's a little wire, and it's got a little tassel-y bit in the front. Too bad, it looks like it's worn. I wonder if polishing it up would help. Oh, 
<laughs> have to pet it. Gotta pet it. There's a cute little earrings missing one of its dangles, but you could take them off and add something else to it. And this is what is this? Oh, it's another one of these that's been added on. And see, here's my here's my question. Why such a strong magnet for an itsy bitsy necklace? I am going to take it off of here, I think. Mm. Oh wait, is that supposed to be on it? What? If I oh wait, no, it'll be fine. That's fine. Eh. Okay, that's two of those. So this is just a little seed bead guy with resin beads on him. <laughs> yeah. Get! Okay. This one. White and tannish. Tannish goldish. This is a teensy tiny ring, and then this is a little Claire's chain, still in pretty good shape, it's like really bright, you know how sometimes these Claire's things get kind of gross. But this one seems to be holding up all right. If I could just get it untangled. Okay. There's that. And then there's this. <sighs> There, there's that little ring. It, it feels like a midi ring to me. It's very tiny. Very tiny. Okay, there we go. We got that undone. Just a little, little chain, little silver tone chain. And this is a piece of something. This is. This is a little Y necklace. Very, very small. Black and clear. The chain is bleh. Gross. Alright, what have we here? Ooh, this is nice. This is a very nice old gold tone chain with Come on. <laughs> With little beads, little heart beads. There's three there and f oh wait, there's five. This is supposed to go like this, I guess. That's strange. It looks like one's missing. Hmm. There's a nice brass one with rhinestones and enamel. Um, but it, the stretch is kind of gone. It's not overstretched, but it doesn't look like it wants to. Oh, wait, yes, it is. Yep, that needs a rework. This is cool. There's the button. There it is. Button closure like this gray and almost like black eyed peas it has earrings to match where did the other earring go where is it where is it well there's a pair of earrings that match it 
Look, it's a little, they look like black eyed peas almost. And it's on this heavy cotton thread and it's tied and it's really cool. And it looks like, looks like your hippie art teacher made it or wears it or something. My back is killing me. Ugh. You ever get that where you're sitting? I usually sit in this chair and have no issue at all. Here's a fun one. Look at that. Big giant hunk of glass. It doesn't have any chips either. It's in great shape. Let me see. It doesn't have any wear on the back either. It doesn't have any markings. It's an 8. Very cool cocktail ring. Nice. Ooh, here's a little black earring. I think I have the other one of these somewhere. Handmade. I love those. Very nice. Ooh. And there's another earring, and another earring, and I don't know what this was, looks like it was a brooch, but no longer, it's broken, boohoo, that'll go in a craft lot, we have a cute little wooden bracelet, with an applied finish on the focal beads, and the uh, the other ones are just natural, it looks like. Have the other one of those. There's a hoop. Oh, there's one of these. I think there's a couple of these in there. Yes. See, this is what I mean. I want to go through my little ones and... Add them to the ones they belong with because I like wearing, you know, I like wearing a whole bunch of these so that it's like this much. I like mixing them up, but I also like making sets with them. Even though they're real cheap and, you know, eh. Not much, much. Okay, I'll check this out. Oh, that one lost its thingy. I thought I had the thingy here. I did. I had I had this one. What the heck? Where'd it go? Yeah. Anyway, I had these when I was in my twenties. These guys. That's why my ears are all messed up. I did not have this pair though missing its black stone. It stinks because I had it a minute ago. Here's a pair of nice old pearly uh, screwbacks, but the problem is the connectors. They've all got they've all got jewelry cancer. Verdigree. Verdigree. Oh boy. What have we here? Oh, look, a little feather ring. I think I know where that's going. That's going somewhere. Very cute. Here's a little brass one. That will go in that bag to be sorted later. Here's another cute little earring. This one is a clip-on and it's missing its focal point as well. Ooh, who is this? Safari. Safari. I've never heard of Safari, have you? Those are pretty. Gold tone with black 
rhinestones, $28 clip earrings. On the card still, those are really pretty. Very nice. It's hard to get them to focus because of the they're so dark. Really nice. Those are fabulous. Got the other one of those. And where's the other one of these? I know I had two of them. Anyway, oh look, here's the other one of those. Very cute. Look, it's a beer opener or a bottle opener. It's an owl with rhinestone eyes. Very cute. Steel, very shiny. Shiny, shiny. Oh, here's the other one. Pair of earrings, very nice. Embossed puffy hearts. They are not, I don't know that they're metal. No, I think they're uh, acrylic. An acrylic, as we used to call it when we were kids, just to make fun of it. Alright, what do we got? Hmm. This is uh, a bent one of these. It's kind of cool, very boho y looking. And then we have oh no, what is this? Diabetes, not on insulin, wears contacts, allergic to stings, blood type O pause. That's a neat thing to have. Tells you all that information. I kind of like these. Meh. Here's a very pretty earring that seems to be missing a stone. Darn it. Here's a pile of stones. Pile of stones. This is a nice has a little twig and two strands with um oh I want to say Catalina beads but that's not it these guys what are they Laguna Laguna crystal beads this is an older one it has a hook that's one of these. Oh, that's pretty with the pearls. Pearls and crystals. Very nice. That might be one for the collection. Here's that. Here's the other one of these. Very cool. Very sparkly. I do have both of them. They are clip. And they have these little dangles at the bottom. Very cool. Here's a squared off bracelet. Square, little squared um, thingamajiggy. Future Madoodle. Oh, look, there's another one of these. There's four of them. There's four of them. Nice. Maybe there's more. Who knows? Here's a big heavy, oh these are wire, these are all wire wrap, like, this is a spiral down the middle, and then this is braided several times, those are nice, nice intricate work, here's another beautiful ring, abalone with resin a resin cab over top it's steel it is only a fashion ring but 
It's really pretty. I like it. Ooh, another ring. Ooh, that's pretty too. It's a shame it's missing stones. It would have been really cool. Or what? Do these guys not supposed to have? Hmm. Let me look a little closer. <gasps> Wait, no. I'll look a little closer and tell you next time because it's time to end the video here. Uh, thank you all for being here. Please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment in the down there. And if you see something you can't live without, please send me the timestamp of the item in which you're interested uh, in the comments below. Um, if you'd like, you can send that same information to my email. Just include the date of the video and the, the title of the video so I can find your item. If you haven't bought from me before, include your name, your address, your PayPal email, and your YouTube name so that I can put everything together, get you invoiced, and get your stuff sent out to you. Remember that I love each and every one of you, and I stink at making that heart. And be yourself. Because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye.